Hey everybody, it's Sharon from Dr. Business Builder. Today I wanted to talk about passive income. Do I believe in passive income? I've said it before in other videos, I don't believe in passive income. Unless you're born into a very rich family and you have a trust fund, there is no thing as passive income as far as I'm concerned. Do me a favor, show me in the comments below what is passive income. So, you need to have some money, right? Or you need to work. It's either that you're gonna have money to create because money makes money is the bottom line, right? Like you can put it into a savings account, you can do interest, CDs, stock market, which is always a little risky, but over long term, it, it's a good investment. You can do real estate, you could, um, there's, if you don't want to be bothered like with rentals and whatnot, there's definitely companies out there that will manage your real estate. All of that takes money. So yes, you can develop passive income from it, but it takes money to start. Then the other option is time. You putting your time into something that's going to allow you to develop passive income. Well, one of the first things that comes to mind is network marketing, right? You build up a team. Do you like network marketing? Maybe network marketing isn't for you, but there's definitely different ways to do it. I've done it before. I'm gonna do another video on network marketing and what you should look at when you're looking at a network marketing team. But that would be one way of doing it. And it's definitely work. Nothing comes easy. What are some other, other things? Well, what are your skill sets, right? Are you a teacher? Do you like to teach? What about teaching some classes online? You can definitely do that. You could do a course. So that would be another great thing that you can do. And then you set it all up. And then from there, what you can do is that would be passive income. It's all going to be automated. You would do landing pages to it. You would tell people about it. And then that would be all automated. And then from there, you can develop a passive income. But it definitely is work to begin with. If you want information on setting up a course, I can definitely help you with that. What are some other things that you can do? Well, you can set up like systems in place, whether it's going to be teaching or courses or books. Um, basically informational products you put it out there you get the people you know whether it's through paid traffic or you have a following and then people buy from it affiliate marketing you can do something like a blog and if you do enough writing well people are gonna follow you on that they're gonna go on your articles themselves and they're gonna click some links and it's gonna and perhaps they'll buy some products that's considered passive income as well, but it was work getting there, right? Like you had to do the blog, you had to do the article. YouTube channel, right? I can put some links where you can go off and buy some products, but I'm sitting here now talking to you about it. It is definitely a little work, and it's some work getting all those systems you know, in place to begin with. But it is a great way, and I, I personally would always think multiple streams of income, I think that's the best way to go, right? Don't limit yourself to just one thing. Don't just do one job. If you're looking to retire early, or you're looking for a better lifestyle, if you're working too hard now, then think of ways that you can make additional income. And this sort of like passive income, developing multiple streams of income is a way to go. At least I think so. So that's pretty much it today. I wanted to come on, I wanted to talk to you about, you know, what are the different ways that you can make income? Look out there, see what other people are doing. What the bottom line is, what are your interests? Because if you're not interested in it, yes, you can go online and learn about it. You can even take some courses to teach about it, but you have to, it has to be in your heart, sorry. It has to be in your heart. That's the bottom line. Because when it's in your heart and, you know, it means a lot to you, it comes through and people are more likely to buy. The other thing is, too, you have to establish relationships with people. Usually. You can do some paid traffic. But even paid traffic, think about when you buy. Why do you buy? You usually buy if you know, know the person, know the company. Uh, something made you feel comfortable about buying. You thought it was a really good deal. You know, they gave quality or there's an established relationship. All of those help to make the sale and you, it's something you need to work on. So again, don't limit yourself. Think about different products that you could possibly do. I think personally, informational products are the best because you don't have to worry about you know having a product and then having to ship it out there. It's all digital, it's downloaded, or you send a link, or you have like a paid membership area. Lots of things that you can do. I have like, a, if you wanna do an online magazine where you basically talk about your um, products and you know you give information, there's great ways to do that. It looks just like, you know, a, I don't know, a graphic designer did it that spent many hours designing it. It doesn't take that long. It's just a matter of swapping out some pictures, changing the text around, and there you go. You have an online magazine. You can make it free. That leads to other things to you know build up a relationship, kind of do it as an opt-in, we call it. Or you could put it in a paid membership where you kind of lock up that area. 
it's again, it's all about you thinking what else you can do with your life, multiple streams of income, getting out there and actually taking action and doing it. So many of us talk about doing things, but do we really do it? Not all the time. So I want to hear about your passive income ideas, just to go over it again, banking, right? Anything that requires money upfront, banking, real estate, investing, and then informational products. That's what I would suggest as far as passive income. All right, lots of courses out there. Anything that you can do, you're not limited by any means. So if you like this video, do me a favor, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you on another, another video. Thanks so much, bye-bye.